My name is Katherine Maitland and I am an elementary education major with a dual endorsement in special education and I'm from Shelburne, Vermont. So my first semester I was at a small private liberal arts college and then after that semester I transferred to UVM, so in the middle of my first year. And I transferred because uh, the college I was at before was really small and they also didn't have my or the major that I wanted to uh, pursue and uh, I looked at UVM and they had a really great education program uh, where I got to go into the field really early on as a sophomore and many different opportunities uh, to be part of different student organizations and clubs so I was really uh, really like that. I honestly I really like being the local uh, because I really feel like I know the area but then at the same time I've also learned a lot about the area. Growing up in Vermont, I'm like, oh yeah, this is just normal, like whatever, there are mountains over there and there's a lake over there, okay. And, uh, but then when my friends come and they're like, whoa, it's so beautiful and wow, like there's a lake and, you know, Church Street is awesome and then, we, you know, just like 30 minutes to the mountain. Even though I do know a lot of people from my high school, I still have many friends that are from different parts of Vermont and then different parts of the country as well. Um, one of my good friends right now um, that's teaching in the same school as me, she's from California. I have a lot of other friends who are from Massachusetts area, New Hampshire, Connecticut. I feel like I'm just constantly meeting new people and that's another amazing part about UVM is there are always new people to meet uh, and really great people to meet too. It's, um, I feel like, oh wow, like I wish I had known this person for longer. Like it's, it's my senior year and I'm, I'm meeting this person only now. Uh, I wish I had gotten to know them more. I love that there are so many different things that you can do academically and socially. So the research I've, I've been doing is with Dr. Juliet Halliday in the elementary education department and we uh, we have been looking at how kindergartners understand informational texts, so nonfiction texts. We actually just ended up um, writing a paper together and then presenting it at a uh, national literacy conference, um, actually the Literacy Research Association. Um, so we went to a conference together um, in California uh, just a few months ago and presented this paper and that was another just amazing experience being around all of these great literacy researchers from around the country. Another really big thing of how to make the most of your time is to study abroad one semester. You learn so much about yourself and about what you are really interested in and passionate about. So then that um, helped me decide that I wanted to uh, go to the Peace Corps after I graduated. Um, and then I've also been part of different service organizations at UVM that have also helped me. Uh, make, make the decision to be part of the Peace Corps. I will be going to the Eastern Caribbean um, and I will be a uh, primary English literacy co-teacher when I'm there. So this might be a kind of small thing when you're thinking about applying to college, but it's a big thing when you actually get onto campus. But the food at UVM, I feel like for a college campus, is really great. They do a really nice job of uh, having uh, local food, which is something that the students have definitely pushed. Um, and it's, you can really tell in the food that's cooked, it's high quality and uh, I'm kind of sad now that I'm not on a meal plan because I can't just easily go and um, get a falafel on Thursdays um, or get some great wraps um, from, the, from the marketplace. When I um, first started going to UVM I was a little concerned because uh, I'm from Shelburne uh, and so my high school was actually farther away from my house than UVM was. But I found when I got on campus, it was just a whole different world. And uh, even though my dad works in Burlington, uh, I don't really see my family that often. Um, it's really just kind of when I want to or um, now that I'm living off campus when I want to do a free load of laundry um, <laughs> or have a nice home cooked meal that I haven't made. <laughs> yeah, it's been really nice to see my dog. <laughs> uh, <laughs>